Fletch, I miss you, buddy. You gotta come out here to the sea. I know it's way too far from Lake Wales, but come on out. Come on out, we miss you. Take care, brother. Thanks, friend. nice a little windy but uh, it's pretty like smooth over by the water yeah it's a little strong but it's butter
The canyons were incredible. Definitely top 10 favorite place to fly. Um, freezing cold, but the uh, winds stayed low for a good chunk of the time we were out there. So smooth butter, carving through the canyons with my girls, Whitney and Nikki, and it was a great time. <laughs>
<laughs> you guys have fun up there or what? Oh yeah, great time. Yeah, good stuff. Fast. I know, he's Come killing me. <laughs> Second hour long flight of the day and it's still not even noon, I think. up high next to the dead glider he's, cir he's circling the dead glider Testing emergency procedures. Yes, we were.
you know, you put your arms out, it's yep. about as wide as, it's wider than your arm span. Yeah. So, yep. it's a big hoop. And you can swing that big on. Yeah. yeah. Can you on? <laughs> Don't feel bad. <laughs> this feels awesome. Yeah. And, and that's the, titanium? It is titanium. Yep. All yep. titanium framing, except for the plating that you use to pump the motor. And that's it. So, the frame is about as light as it comes. And the geometry of it is such that it's pretty comfortable. And the nice thing about it is it's adjustable too. You can lift it up higher on your back or lower on your back. It's a very, it's a highly adjustable, you know, limitless adjustability. Yeah. <laughs> That's yeah. the small harness with the Atom, the big prop. It's feeling comfy. It's I like machine. it. It feels good. Yeah. Brad Roper with Southern Utah Paramotor. We're out here at Salton Sea, California at the uh, Salton Sea Gathering, and I'm going to fly the EFI Moster. I'm really looking forward to a linear power band so I can foot drag all day long. Motor's good, super smooth, buttery smooth. So you can foot drag all day, you put your RPM precisely where you want it. Um, immediately I noticed there's less fatigue when you're not fighting the throttle, the power band the whole time. You just put it right where you want it, hold it. Um, you're not having to modulate back and forth, so it's super nice. I fly a Fellini, so I'm, I'm used to that and I recognize that. Uh, for somebody that hasn't flown an EFI, it's probably gonna take some time to appreciate that. But a couple hours of flying it, or like a long cross country, you definitely notice the power band is much, much better. So, thumbs up for me. My hang point's super far forward, so I can't tell a ton, but uh, I didn't notice torque, which means it's probably doing a good job. Thanks, bro. Thanks for letting me fly it. We're gonna send her. Oh yeah, heck yeah. First time on the EFI. Um, my name's Jordan Honeyman. I'm from Sky Ventures PPG up in Logan, Utah, and we're gonna see what this thing's all about, so. That's slick, I like that. And obviously one click kill, right? Yep. Alright.
<laughs> I was rushing to get over here. <laughs> that was great, man. Uh, ironically, the only times I've ever flown a Limitless was a Factory R was on it. And this thing reminded me a lot of it. It's got that smooth power band. And the power's there because you got a 140 prop. It just, it felt very similar and, and it just really smooth, really, really smooth. And I like that starting procedure a lot too. That's, that's slick as hell. So yeah, man, this thing is, this thing's awesome. I'm pretty stoked on it. Honestly, that'd be, be a fun thing to have. Oh so. yeah. What do you think about the torque compensation on there? So right now it, that motor's set up neutral. So I did notice that a little bit too. You can definitely tell I was trying to do a little bit of parabolas up there. I was trying to do a little bit of parabolas up there too, and I was trying to get to the top of that arc. I can definitely feel it. Of course, when you get you know no air speed, it'll stop. But yeah, you can definitely tell it getting hard coming up. It feels very straightforward. There's no brake input needed. As long as I was right into that wind, it was perfect. So yeah, they're definitely they're definitely noticeable on there. So compared to the last time I flew one, even too. So sweet, All right? Sweet yeah. man, that was awesome. Thank you. Yeah. So what do we got going on here? Got some butt fan shirt. <laughs> Some butt fan shirts? Some butt fans. Who makes fans. those? Kelly Stanley. Who's that? You know, owner, operator, only butt fans. It's a good time. You should get one. Sauce all day. Neil told me you guys got some EFI. You want to try it? Yeah. 
<laughs> yeah, let's do it. I'm Dimitri from Meyer Spare Motor. Uh, we also run West Coast Spare Motors, which is a Viterazzi distributor. We're gonna fly Aviators Limitless with the EFI. And uh, I haven't flown one yet. I haven't actually seen one up close, so I get to check it out, uh, see how it feels on my back, and then fly it. Yeah, it actually does not feel nearly as heavy as I would expect it to. So it's definitely more than a Moster and definitely more than a, a dual start, but it's not unmanageable whatsoever. So you said, yep, just double tap to start it. Yep. Click once and hold. Excellent. And it's completely cold. All right. So I noticed right away that it sounds like a completely different engine and I don't, I don't know if it's the prop or if it's actually just uh, the fact that it runs a different fueling but uh, I really like how the low RPMs you can just set it to whatever RPM you want and it just stays there. Um, yeah, uh, I have a lot of experience with EFI so it does exactly what EFI should which is it delivers pretty much perfect fueling it seems like through the, their whole RPM range. Um, so I dig it, I dig it, it, it feels good. Like it's not nearly as heavy as I expected, but we also don't have any fuel in there, so th there's that. <laughs> cool, thanks for letting me fly, man. I appreciate it. Yeah, I had a great time up there.
Uh, I, I wing tip bumped uh, the guy that was in that van over there. It was pretty fun. And I did a lot of foot drags. It was awesome. My name is Texas Boatwright. I'm from uh, Kansas City, Missouri. I'm 16 years old. Uh, started flying when I was 14. Uh, I've been foot launching for almost uh, a year and like a couple months now. I've been flying trike. I started on trike and I've been flying trike for three years total. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got four years under his belt training when he was so small he couldn't even foot launch. We used to put him on a trike, but now he's getting big. <laughs> Ripping a Sirocco 18 meter. Wing overs are starting, foot drags are crushing, launches and landings are clean. Orange bear jet, orange wing. I think it's pretty sick. Nice. Are your goggles orange though? Nope. Are your boots orange? Nope. Bro, we gotta step up oh, the dude. orange game. Come on, dude. Yo, yo, your dad loves orange too and you ain't got orange stuff. Mom, we got together. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Trace Boatwright. Um, we live in Kansas City, Missouri. I think I'm gonna try to go to SIV course um, this year, and I, I want to be able to do an Infinity Tumble. That's my the main goal. And a rocket loop. Hey, I'm Tori Pope. I'm out of Libby, Montana, I'm out the Salton Sea here, flying paramotors and uh, just having a good time in general. Uh, meeting a lot of cool people and uh, just checking out the awesome scenery, digging the vibe. Been flying paramotors for about five years and uh, I'm a self trained pilot, some people, you know, but whatever. I'm still here doing my thing. We were rocking the canyons when the days were permitting because it can be bumpy out there, but when it's nice, it's nice. Uh, followed a bunch of guys coming back, got some really cool footage on my GoPro, and it's gonna be some good memories for me. Yeah, I just, I love flying and I don't ever see myself quitting. Well, I'll thank my girlfriend for letting me just take off and do my own thing. You know, some women aren't like that. They're like, ah, what are you gonna do? I'm like, ah, you know, but she's understanding. Um, I really just enjoy all the people out here. It's just good camaraderie between pilots. Um, I don't think I've met an asshole yet. <laughs>
How was it? It was excellent. It's beautiful up there. You should be going up and down the beaches with us, my man. It's very, very fun. notice about this is with especially with the long prop uh -huh. is you're gonna feel the thrust but uh -huh. it's not as much as your moster uh -huh. but I like it because it's it, you'll climb pretty uh -huh. quickly which I love that a lot yeah. thank you go have thank fun you. man yeah. you're gonna love it yep. I'm Rizu Desai and I came from Santa Clara uh, California and I'm going to try that uh, 140 prop with atom 80 and limitless, uh, limitless model. Yeah, I like it. Sweet. And what is the thrust compared to your Moser? Uh, I didn't feel any difference in launch because uh, anyway I don't launch on full throttle because of my weight. Uh, but in climb rate there is there is some difference. But like launch was uh, similar to maybe easier with this because of lighter motor.
adjust on the on the limitless swing arms. Super easy, get really precise. Hi, my name is Tucker Gott and I am demoing the Limitless with the EFI for Aviator Show. <laughs> Not gonna be able to use any of this footage. <laughs> Now hold enter and go up. At least to 1.4. At least 1.4. I would say you got at least two. Don't we'll try to fly around the lake. Right, no no no. Press once and then hold. And you don't even have to flip it, it's just it'll just warm up and run. Shit. That is legit. Ooh. I like that. I like that off idle. Nice punchy off idle. Wow, that's that's nice. That's much more punchy than my Fellini. Water machine! So it sounds like you had some fun. Smoothest power band ever. Definitely like four stroke power band. I'm like 2.7 liters an hour. Level flight, second green line, heavy loaded. Pretty good. Heck yeah, what do yeah. you think about the frame? Pretty rad. Uh, torque wasn't actually that bad. I mean, it's there, but it's not that bad. Pretty good. I. Uh, Swing arms are nice and uh, like weight shift is good. Swing arms aren't sticky. Yeah, pretty rad. Thank you. The gang is flying from Johnson's Landing over to Bombay Beach, which is all the way on the other side of the lake. Uh, I'm the support vehicle, got fuel, got cameras, got one wheels. Going to have a good time. What up, dog? What's happening? How's the flight? Good. It's really good. <laughs> Ow. Woo! <laughs> that good, huh? So exciting. Yeah. That's the farthest I've flown, so. Woo! <laughs> Lots of woo. <laughs> Can't escape me. <laughs> How was it? We made it. It was, it was, beautiful it was serene and gorgeous and a little cold but not too bad and it was great how do you like that motor you're flying what are you flying i'm flying a limitless with a moster 
Um, it had a very full tank of gas, so it was a little heavy, but really great in the air. Loved it, super comfy. Yeah, awesome. chaos that just happened were you I expecting thought, that i was not expecting it um i was really stoked to be a part of it and yeah hopefully in the next year or two i'd love to be up in the sky myself out really nicely tonight. <laughs> How was your flight, sir? That was a lovely flight. That was pretty sweet. Love a canyon run in the evening. Yeah, I want to thank Canyon and I want to thank Boyd. Thank you very much. Oh, you guys got in there. oh yeah. Yeah. Drank. Yep. And then we got to make it dirty for you, Dave. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yep. You ready to make it dirt dirty? Go, go, make it dirty. Nice. Snacks and snacks. Snacks. You missed all the good stuff. <laughs> Salton Sea fly-in has come to an end. Things are very quiet out here, as you can see. If you didn't see yourself in this week's episode, there's lots more to come. We fly across the lake, we go to Glamis Sand Dunes, and just tune in for the next Salton Sea edit. It's gonna be a fun time. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you on the next one. Well. <laughs>